Greetings from Penny Bryn Nature Reserve on this fine December day. I'm on my annual trip in North Wales visiting the family. I haven't seen them in six months since they came to see me in Dublin back in the summer. So I'm going to enjoy this week. Maybe I'll take in a visit to Rill, perhaps I'll run into some old faces, we shall see. This has been uh, quite a year, a transitional one for sure. Back in February was the adventure in the Big Apple, which was a lot of fun, for sure. Then in May I got to see the German capital for the first time. Well, first time anywhere in Deutschland. And that was a really cool experience. Not long after this, I came to the decision that I needed to change jobs. The uh, brutal 12-hour shifts were yeah, where, I, where I had been for the last four years. I had to change, things had to change. So I left. I just told the bosses straight that I needed to find something more suitable for a man in his 40s, a man with a dodgy lower back. I didn't have anywhere to jump to, but I jumped anyway. In late August, that was. And then in September, that was the big trip to the Philippines to meet my lovely girlfriend Charlotte for the first time. And I'm very happy that I did. I had the privilege of meeting her family and doing a tour de force of vanilla, seeing the sights. So yeah, that was my favourite two weeks of the year. Just amazing, lovely. Being off from work for a certain amount of time gave me the opportunity to write my memoir titled I'm Not Britney Spears. You'd have to read the introduction to understand my reasoning for the title, or I guess my reasoning. Anyway, I didn't know going into it how writing that book would make me feel dredging up memories, old names, places and faces but as it so happened I got a kick out of it it was cathartic and yeah I'm glad I got it out of my system then in October after a brief but intensive job search I managed to land a new gig working for a well-known Irish business in Dundrum. I think I've gotten quite lucky here with the pace of the work and the new people around me. The last couple of months could have gone a lot worse so I'm grateful for having landed on my feet here. Luck has been on my side. And so I find myself in a fairly good place mentally and physically. Even though I'm getting older and my body is definitely feeling it, I've got no cause for any serious gripes as things stand. Next year I'll be jumping headlong into the writing project, which I've already got going really, writing a novel. The ideas are already coming and yeah, so I'm going to continue on with that for, you know, quite a while into next year. And I also have a mind to travel in the spring, but I have no firm plans there as of yet. I'll keep my options open. Yeah. So with all that said, I'll leave you with this woodland view and I'll bid you a fair and pleasant day, folks. <laughs>